You must be the one Pericles sent. I am. He said there was an ostracism vote, but didn't tell me what I'm here to do. Of course he didn't. That's what I'm for. What does someone have to do to be ostracized? Anyone seen as a threat to the city or the people is enough. And then it is up to the vote. Some have been ostracized for simply being more disliked than the person they're up against. If someone is exiled, can they return? If they do, they'll be punished. What's my role in this? The votes have already been cast. We don't have long before they're counted. Take the Ostraka in this bag and exchange them with the ones currently under guard. You want me to rig the ostracism? Pericles does, and he has his reasons, I'm sure. Bring me the bag you took from the room and I'll take care of the rest. No one will see me go in or out. Stay here. Αβίνα τον εστί. Gods from all over the Greek world. You wouldn't think the city was besieged by an army of Spartans. Stay hidden if I don't want to fight.
Вот у зад. Стоп, Райдер! I should let Pericles' contact know. Υπάρξει τα It's done. Hmm. You work quickly. What are you going to do with them? Dump them in a well. Ah, it looks like the official has arrived. The votes have been tallied. Overwhelmingly, the people have decided that Anaxagoras should be ostracized from Athens! Be slow to fall into friendship, but once you do, continue firm and constant. It will be more difficult for me now that Anaxagoras must leave Athens. We were quite close, although he and Pericles were much closer. It's strange, Pericles wasn't here today to defend him. You said you were close. He was like a mentor to me. Many of my best thoughts came to fruition through our conversations. Would Pericles normally defend someone? A good friend? Of course, yet Anaxagoras seems pleased with the result. This day has brought more questions than answers. Who are you? 
Ask anyone and they'll tell you Socrates. But a name gives you nothing. Our actions determine who we are, and every action has its pleasures and its price. With that said, then, who do you claim to be? My name is Cassandra. And still, I don't feel I know you. Perhaps I can find out who you are a different way. You want to know me? Knowledge is the one good in this world. Surely you agree? Of course. Knowledge drives everything I do. Then we are the same in that way. Knowledge of when to attack, what weapon to use, or when to use reason instead of violence. We seem to put our love of knowledge into practice quite differently. I use it how I need to. You are clearly someone who would do whatever you feel is necessary. Perhaps for Drachmi, or maybe to further a personal goal. That describes a lot of people. I suppose I'm curious why you did it. How could I not be when you're the reason my friend is being forced to leave the only home he's ever known? I did what I was asked to do. And your needs are greater than those of the man you helped ostracize. Still, you raise a fine point. Who is more responsible? Anaxagoras for getting himself mixed up in this? Or you, for simply sealing his fate? I'm not responsible for his actions. I have one thing to think about, my own. Then I hope you also think about today, about Anaxagoras, about choice. Socrates, there you are. Here I am. You're late. They're all waiting for you. I wish to see Anaxagoras' fate, and so I have. Tell them I'm on my way. Well, it seemed our conversation is at its end. Although I hope it isn't the final one we have. I wouldn't know. Keep 
it moving. Sorry about that. How did you get past the guard? No one gets past the guard. Relax. Ericles sent me. Ah, praise Athena. I knew he'd send help. I was worried they sent someone after me. They? Who? The shadows in the night. Why you fear falling asleep? They're hunting me. Us. No one is safe in Athens anymore. The cult of Cosmos. You know about them. Of course I know about the cult. Here, look at this. These are instructions. On how to kill me. But they've been torn. Then Pericles isn't just getting you out of Athens to save you from the trial. He's saving you from being murdered. I don't know who to trust. I'm just an artist. I just wanted to create. Please, what am I to do? First, you need to pull yourself together. You're on trial, the people are against you, and now I find that the cult want to kill you. Uh... I said pull yourself together! Yes, of course. Cleon said you're wasting the people's drachmi. If he had his way, he'd serve them your head. Cleon mentioned me? That's going to hurt Pericles. First impiety, now theft. After all we've done for this city. You and Pericles seem close. For Pericles and me, it started with our love of Athens. Our differences push us to greatness. That is true friendship. All right, we need to go. Do you have any idea where I can take you? South of Athens, there's an island called Seriphos. My friend Theras lives there. When I discovered the plot against me, I sent word to him. If anyone can help us, he can. Any clues he has of the cultists' identities, I want them. Yes, yes, anything. A guard! I'll distract them while you sneak out. Meet me tonight to set sail for Seriphos. Don't show your face until you see me at the docks. I understand. You didn't really think I'd let you come and go as you please, did you? Now, where are you?
So many boats. Good. You made it. I was beginning to worry. I told you I'd get you out of Athens. So you did. Can your friend be trusted? Theras and I have been friends for a long time. I just sent word telling him where to meet us. Wasting time will only get us into trouble. Let's head to Serifos while we still can. Nice ship. You don't have to do that. Do what? Fill the silence. Oh, I wasn't trying to do that at all. I simply don't find myself traveling the seas very often. To be free. Yes, freeing seems to be an accurate word. Although I've begun to feel a bit sick. You know what side if you need to. Otherwise you're king. There are powerful enemies here, Commander. We should be careful. Is your stomach turning as much as mine is? You'll get used to it. We'll reach Serifos before long. Watch them, Commander! They are getting this way! Rowers can't keep this up, Commander! Until further orders.
There's much to do, and many unknowns on our horizon. It's good to see you alive and well, Phidias. And you, Theras. As you can see, I didn't get here alone. Ah, yes. The kind and thoughtful hero you mentioned in your letter. If I wasn't getting something out of it, he'd be dead already. And for that heroism, I found some information on a man named Brisson who's plotting Phidias' early demise. Hopefully you can make something of this clue. I can. Please give Pericles my thanks and my farewell. And be careful. I still believe many in Athens are in danger. Thank you again. Don't forget to come see me under less stressful circumstances. I swear on my life and the lives I will take from others, I will not fail the cosmos again. not to get spotted. little girl doing in a clay pit. Oh, Mistios. Hi, Mistios. I'm just preparing something for my friends. I've been here all day, but I still need more clay. I need enough for all of them. What you're doing for your friends is very nice. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Really? You think so? I was thinking of getting them some other things, though. You're a generous friend. What do you want to give them? I want to give them some nice jewelry. <laughs> you mean jewelry? That's what I said. You don't look like you could afford any, honestly. I know. That's why I was going to get some shiny stones in the abandoned mines and a few pearls from the lagoon. But I've been stuck here all day with the clay, and the abandoned mines are kind of scary. Do you think you could help me get some gifts for my friends? It makes them happy and that'll make me happy. I'll make some gooey for you too, for helping me. Gladly, young lady. I'll see to it you get the best pearls and shiny stones. And I wouldn't mind some jewelry myself. Yay, thank you. You're really nice for a big scary looking person. Where are all your friends? They'll be coming soon, just a little longer. Speak up, child. I can't hear you. Never
Never mind. I'll introduce you to them later. Where are these abandoned mines with your shiny stones? The mine is in the metal, west of the temple. I'll see what I can find. These pearls you talked about, where can I find them? North of the clay pits, in the lagoon. They're just sitting there in the water, but there are some big sarks in there. Be careful. Okay, that's all I need to know. I'll see you later. I should be done here soon. Meet me at the cliff overlooking the lagoon, okay? I'll introduce you to my friends. Thanks, Mythios. That's the lagoon with the pearls. Ah, the mines. That's where the shiny stones are. Abandoned mines with the shiny stones. This weren't too hard to find.
This is the lagoon the little girl mentioned. shiny stones. I should return to the little girl. She got here sooner than I thought she would. Silly Theo, don't put that in your hair. You look funny. Mistyos, you made it just in time. My friends have finally arrived. I don't see anyone else here but us. <laughs> what? Silly Mistyos, can't you see them? They're right over there. The one on the left is Theo, and the one on the right is Erla. They look friendly, but I don't think they really count as your friends. What do you mean? They're my friends. I made them. I know you made them, but that... Mother told me to make friends, Mistyos, and I did. This isn't a way to make friends. Tell your mother that... I can't! She's dead, Mistyos. Mother is dead. She joined the pirates told me she'll bring back so much drachmi. We could swim in it. But, but, but one day she came back, Mistyos. Her favorite white robe was all red. And she told me to take care of myself and make more friends. But 
I've never had any friends. I didn't know what she meant. So I thought really, really hard and made my friends out of clay. Did I make a mistake? Matur won't be upset at me, right? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. No, child, no. You did great. Your mother would be proud of you. Friends come in all shapes and sizes. I have an eagle, and he's a close friend of mine. Wow, really? That's so cool. Here you go. Your gifts for your friends, as promised. Why don't you go put them on for them? I'm sure they'll like that. Thank you, Miss Dios. You're the best. I'll go do that right now. I'm sorry, child. I could not break your heart, even if it was good for you. I should check in on her later. 